everyone, it's Kathy, and I have another journal to share with you. This one's a ring-bound journal with a sewing theme. Uh, it seems that the sewing theme is pretty popular, so I went ahead and made um, another one. This one measures six by eight and a half inches and has 24 pages, not counting the front and back covers. Uh, the front cover you can see was done with some fabric collage and some linen in the background and then a vintage photo. The, on the rings I have a cute little mini journal. actually has some pages in there. and then some lace and some fabric. The closure is done with a um, clip. Just holds that cover down. The inside front cover is done with, done with designer paper and a um, that Tim Holtz uh, a die that's uh, I'm not sure what it's called that has all the little slits for you to put in lots of ephemera and the next page is a collage of some lace um, and a rusty pin and a cute little charm it's a spool of thread The next page has a glassine bag with a tag. The next page is a pattern paper. You can see it's on both sides and then it's made into a pocket and it has a little journaling booklet. some stamping on the side and the next page it has a denim pocket with some journaling cards and this page has a doily pocket with a tag and a button and a envelope that has Lots of areas for information you want to put in here, little snippets, has a journaling card in the pocket. You can journal on the back of that. Um, this idea came from Bohemian Crafting. She has lots of great ideas for using envelopes little chain and again this flips out and it's also a little pocket you can, you can put anything in there and the next page is another little snippet some lace and some fabric and a cute little vintage photo And the next page is a fabric pocket with a film um, slide, one of those slide folders. It has a rusty pin and another little charm of some scissors. And then the back is a pocket as well with an altered guest check paper dolls. The next page has a side pocket with another booklet for journaling. Lots of pages in there. And has a ticket that's just held with one of these cute little clips. 
next page has a lace pocket with a tag. And then on this page is a linen fabric with a rusty pin and some lace. And that just flips up to another linen pocket with a journaling card. And on this page, there's a cute little girl at her sewing machine. And then there's little slits with small tags. And then this one has a bingo card and another journaling card. And then on this page is an envelope on a merchandise bag. <clears throat> Excuse me, with two little pattern envelope cards. And inside the bag is another journaling booklet made out of a glassine envelope. And here you have a card for some journaling. Actually, it's a little booklet. And then pages for journaling. And then in the back is another pocket with another journaling card. Some fabric and lace snippet. And then a pocket with another journaling card. <clears throat> and then on this page is a music sheet page and the actual song is details in the fabric so that was kind of cute with a lace pocket with some other snippets of lace and a fabric tag and then you've got one of those Tim Holtz little clips with a little bit of bling. And then this opens up and you've got a little pocket there with some journaling cards. And then you can put that back on there. And the next page is a um, embossed bingo card with a vintage photo and then that flips open and it's the same on the other side with a doily and a little tag and then in the pocket is a fabric tag with a thimble charm and a ball pin And then on this page is a pocket with a little snippet of some lace and a file folder. That's a little mini journal. And then the next page is a little flip up, it just opens up here, and the paper clip, let me just flip that up, and there's a ticket and another pattern envelope card, and that just slides in there, close that up, and then put your little Keep a clip to hold that down. And then this page is another flip out of an envelope with another pattern 
envelope card. And then inside are some more journaling cards. That's just plain. And then we have the lady at the sewing machine. You can journal on that. And then here's a pocket with a couple of little tickets. And this page is a Battenberg lace pocket, rusty pin, it says vintage. And then another journaling booklet with a cute little sewing machine charm. And then several pages for journaling. And this page is a the back is a glassine envelope and with some collage on the front. And then inside are some journaling cards. And then this page has an envelope or coin envelope, policy envelope. And inside that is a little booklet for journaling. And then behind that is one of those jewelry envelopes with another sewing machine and some cute little paper dolls, collage, papers, and enough room that you can store some memorabilia in there or notes. And then the inside back cover has a belly band with another booklet. And this is a mini journal. It has lots of pages in here for journaling. And then the back cover has few snippets of fabric and that's the closure, back of the closure and so that just closes just clip that on and closes like that so there you have my latest journal this is um, a fun journal for for you sewers out there, really cute. Um, you can use it for your uh, ideas, your creativity, pictures, whatever you think suitable. This would make a great gift for someone who sews. Uh, it is available for purchase. Contact me at Kathy Cadeal at yahoo.com. I'll give you all the details. I, I thank you all for your comments and for all your sweet messages. If you have not subscribed, be sure to do so. Um, you will be notified of any future journals that I post. So thanks again for watching and thank you for, um, again, for all your comments. And I hope to see you in the next video. Bye for now.